<clears throat> hey there, Zach here. I found myself in Arizona in this uh, in this parking lot here, and uh, this is the location that I found. I I'm not exactly sure uh, why it's here. I, I think it's a trailhead, but um, as I'm walking around, um, of course it's very very hot here. I've I've gotten this idea. Um, of a place that I want to sleep tonight. So normally I sleep in here. Oh, there's my slack line. But normally I sleep in here and got the mattress and I'll, I'll pop my windows because it does get really, really hot, especially in a confined area. So I had this idea that I want to go ahead and pull my mattress off and go ahead and put it on the top of my car here. I honestly don't know if this is a good idea. Maybe I'll roll off in the middle of the night. It, it's looking like we have no rain, which is a really, really good sign. But I think, I think that's what I'm gonna go ahead and do, is pull my mattress and go ahead and put it on top of the car. So the first thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and find a spot that's gonna be flat enough um, for me to at least have the car level so when, I, when I'm sleeping, I'm gonna be level. And uh, yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and move the car now and then we'll pull the mattress and get it put up top. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and move my car from right there to right there in that, in that spot right here. Seems like it'll be a great location and I'm facing that way, which is always a plus. All right, well, I got the car parked. I'm gonna go ahead and show you uh, the gauge that I used to make sure I had it parked exactly the way I want it. It's uh, perfectly flat this way, so zero degrees um, left and right, and it's tilted forward two degrees. So it's it's a, a feature that's actually built into this car. But um, let me go ahead and turn it on and I'll show you. Oh, you might be able to see it right there. So this is two degrees front and back and zero degrees side to side. So it's a really nice feature that after a few attempts allowed me to uh, get the car exactly how I want it. And now I'm gonna have a, oh, now I'm gonna have a uh, decent surface up top to sleep on. top of the car <clears throat> the top of the car is pretty nasty but should be fine <laughs> Now we're talking. <laughs> Unreal. Let me get up here. This is incredible. That's pretty unreal. I, this is gonna do. This is gonna do for sure. And I don't even need a blanket. I mean, it's just, just perfect. Hopefully I don't fall off. <laughs> that, would, that would suck. Well, here we are on top of the car, getting ready to break out the drone. Also got the guitar for later. There's my pillow. It's fantastic. This is fantastic. First time I've done this. I don't know how, but let's go ahead and uh, throw the drone up. See what we can uh, see what we can find. Unbelievable.
Hi friends, well, uh, it was a little too dark to get any uh, aerial shots of me on, on top here. But uh, maybe tomorrow morning, so I'll definitely break it out then. But we did get a, a good look at the uh, at the sunset there. But uh, I'll probably just play play my guitar for a little bit tonight and uh, then go to bed. And we'll see what happens. I uh, I might wake up early or I might sleep in. I, I honestly have no idea. And I'm interested to see how much these, uh, like the gnats, how much these bugs are going to play a part in my in my night here. So I'm going to go to bed and uh, I'll see you guys in the morning. Well, it's the middle of the night, and I've decided that um, I'm going to go down and grab a blanket because it, it's getting kind of windy, and uh, it'll be a perfect time to grab a, a nice drink of water. This is how I open the door from up here. I just put my foot into the... kind of jam my left foot through like that. And there we go, that's how I open the door. And then I just put my foot right there. And that's what goes there. And just like that, we're down. And I'm gonna grab a blanket and some water. Good morning, everybody. The sun has started to rise here. Beautiful look from the cacti. Anyways, here's my blanket from yesterday. Just a super thin sheet. It definitely gets the job done. There's a very strong wind coming from here. So, I would sleep breezing this way. I'd have the wind to my back. And, uh, definitely got the job, but beautiful view. Alright friends, I just met uh, this guy right here. He's actually headed towards a nude beach, which is what he requested. I looked it up for him. And we found it and it's just up the road that way. A uh, great guy, interesting character for sure. But um, yeah, I just finished flying the drone and uh, captured some, some fantastic footage to say the least. It's just unbelievable how gorgeous it is up here. <laughs> Got the sunrise in here. <laughs> Got beautiful landscapes that surround. And it was a pretty good night sleeping up here. I mean, I still haven't put the drone away yet. It's just hanging out, but yeah, it was a surprisingly good night of sleep, especially after I got that blanket. It helped shield me from the wind, because there was, you might be able to hear it actually, but there was a really, really heavy wind coming from up there, coming this way, so. Yeah, you can, I, I imagine you can hear that wind, but uh, what a what a night and a great morning. It's been an absolutely fantastic morning up here on top of the truck. I'm uh, preparing to go ahead and, and start taking everything down. Um, so it, it starts with me unlocking or opening the door with my foot the same way I did in the middle of last night. And uh, the sun is coming out. I'm just getting pretty hot, not gonna lie.
but um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and, and uh, start bringing everything down. What a beautiful toss. Well, the bed's back in. And just like that, we're back to normal. Top is clear. What an unbelievable 12 hours it's been. I got to, uh, got a chance to try something new. And uh, sleeping on top is probably something I'm gonna have to do again. But um, it's time to wrap it up here at this location. I'm off towards the airport in Tucson, Arizona to pick up my brother. And Dylan and I will be traveling for the next uh, week or so. And we'll be hitting up, uh, we'll go uh, north through Arizona. We'll swing over to Vegas. We'll come back into Utah. And, uh, you know, we'll go through Zion and Moab. And uh, we'll see Arches National Park. And I imagine much, much more. But this is going to wrap it up for this one. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. Yeah!